students we are talking about the classification of elements it is one of the most basic topic which we have to study in order to understand chemistry okay so let us see how we will predict the particular placement of a element if we know its atomic number okay now for that what we have to do we have to remember the placements of few elements what are those first one is noble gases as you know that noble gases are present at the last of periodic table correct now let us see what are the noble gases and what are their respective atomic numbers okay so the first noble gas is helium whose atomic number is 2 next is neon whose atomic number is 10 next argon 18 krypton 36 xenon 54 and radon 86 along with that we have to also remember the 12th group which is the ending of d block elements so the first member of 12th group is zinc which is belonging to fourth period and its atomic number is 30 next is cadmium mercury 80 and then last is copernicium 112 okay now what else we have to remember we have to remember the third group sixth period because over here there are many elements which are involved in this particular group what are those the particular element with atomic number 57 to 71 belongs to third group and sixth period next is third group seventh period third group seventh period contain atomic number 89 to 103 okay remember all this now let us say that i am having a particular atomic number 35 how to know to which period and which group it belongs so as you know that 36 that is krypton is belonging to 18th group and it is belonging to fourth period that means as it is 35 means it will be a part of fourth period only and as the number is one less than the noble gas implies it will be belonging to 17th group correct now let us say that i am having a particular element with atomic number 75 now if i am talking about 75 then you remember that from 57 to 71 belongs to third group and sixth period implies as this number is close to that means it will belong to sixth period only okay now as till 71 it belongs to third group implies 75 will belong to seventh group okay so this is how you will predict the position of a particular element by knowing its atomic number okay to make your concept stronger and stay ahead in your learning journey join me and other subject matter experts on Turito app for daily free concept classes download the app right now